All right, got a bunch to do today, mostly videos for this coming week, but first, coffee with my friend Jacob Carlson, who you might know. He's a photographer, a videographer from New York City. One time he took a medium format photo of me in 368. I'll see if I can find that. I think he's traveling from Chicago back to New York. He's like, I'd love to see Harrisburg. I'm like, let's meet up. So, uh, what's up, dude? Yo. I was just saying you <laughs> shot a you shot a photo of me on like some medium format camera in 368 one time and then yeah. now you're carrying this around. What's what's this guy? A twin lens reflex camera that I got for 40 bucks when I was home. Oh yeah. yeah. This is cool, man. Wow. It's the first roll I'm putting through it, so it, first roll? Yeah, it's I tested it and it seems to work, but we'll see how it goes. Yeah, right, you never know. I haven't got my Sony A7S3 yet. Are these new cups? Dude, this camera is just so <laughs> so pretty. Do you want to look look through it? Yeah. Right, it's a social thing. So oh, good, man. Dude, that is fun, man. I have a addiction, a problem with collecting film cameras. I I really I only like to get ones that I can use and shoot with. But I started my trip back home with three cameras, three film cameras that I took with me and I'm heading back to New York City with nine. <laughs> Did you say nine? Nine, yes. I acquired six cameras while I was home. But they were all super cheap, and I'm probably gonna sell a few of them. Um, but... That's what we tell ourselves, dude. Yeah. What's your favorite thing to shoot? I like, I like experimenting with everything, but like especially during the pandemic in New York, like, you know, it was really bad, obviously, there uh, for a long time. And the thing that got me out of the apartment that was still safe was going around and doing like neighborhood street photography. In my neighborhood, I live in bed which is a very traditionally poor, but now like very vibrant and cool, eclectic neighborhood. It's great walking around just a few blocks around my apartment and just finding new things to snap photos of, things I've seen a bunch of times and looking at them in a new way. So and that's what I sort of like to do in New York City is like just grab whatever camera I have and, and take photos of stuff. I just sat down because we're grabbing some photos <laughs> and uh B and H just sent me my shipment notification for the H7S3. Come on! <laughs> Jacob just gave me some expired 35 millimeter film from 2006, so that should be interesting. And this Polaroid Duo Chrome, which I'm super hyped about. Look at this. A7S3 coming on Tuesday. <laughs> I'm kind of sad though because like I've fallen in love with the EOS R over the last 12 days of daily vlogging. Like I, I know it, you know, like I know it and I love it and I and so to now dive into another camera, it'll be okay. It'll all be okay. <laughs> Dude, thank you so much for coming out. Hey, thanks for meeting up with me. I appreciate it. It was good seeing you. Camera number three. Great seeing you. <laughs> Definitely gotta test this out, see if it see if it works, see if it does good. Jacob said it might be like the color cast might be a little bit weird. Normally it works, he thinks it was stored well, but it's 14 years old. So kind of excited about it. Gotta work on these videos. I will do that. I will check back in while I do this. I just want you to know. I know it's hard to think of comments to comment. If you have been enjoying the daily vlogs, would highly appreciate it if you just go down there, write in the comments and say, Cody been enjoying the daily vlogs. It's like, you see the, the view numbers 
And it's just like, that's a lot of people. So I just, you know, sometimes if I can put a name, just a name to those numbers, that's just like really helpful for me. So do that. All right, this video is about the GoPro Hero 9. Let's go. I had, I was, I got so into putting that film in there that I totally forgot that my A7S III is coming on Tuesday. All the B-roll sort of that I'm analyzing done for that. And then uh, got my script typed out of every, all the pickups that I need to capture of me talking about it. Gonna go home and eat some dinner. Kids are in bed. Just gotta go record these pickups, throw it all together. Video one done. And then video two, we'll see if I start on it tonight or if I just do it in the morning. <laughs> I'll be honest, I don't want to go do this, but I, uh, I'm going to. What did you say, Ann? I vote morning for the second video because I just know that you don't like to work after the girls go to bed. That's like your sacred time. <laughs> All right. Look at this spot back here. I think it's gonna be rad. All right, I got this street lamp. There's a little rim light there. You like that? You like that? I thought you did. I just need to show you how I recorded that entire video. <laughs> it was just nine minutes of me just standing like this. All right, you heard Amber. Video number two has to wait until the morning. Thanks for being here. Hit the buttons, like the bells. See you tomorrow. Hey, we've jumped to our next location. Where are we now, Jacob? St. Mark's Place. St. Mark's Place. <laughs> and we've... Whoa, pizza delivery. Two brothers. Two, two brothers, brothers pizza. Two bros. Are you, Who are you guys? Are you guys? What? <laughs> <laughs>